This video brought to you by EquestrianCoach.com, the world's leading equestrian education source. Here's the USCT. Hawkins still looks like Hawkins. It looks practically exactly the same in the stables. Now this was a ring in between the stables. That ring is not there. There are more stables and vans. There's Bird to Nimothy in his late 40s. Frankie Leach and Rivera Wonder. Here are the stable plaques, the trophies. You get the trophies. There's Sancier, Henri Sancier with Patricia Galvin. There's Karen McIntosh. There's Sancier. There's Hans Gunther Winkler with Bird to Nimothy. There's Sancier. Beautiful suspension in the dressage. Bird on uh, the Palomino horse with Nautical. Now we're walking the course in Aachen. It was typical, very heavy rain. There's Bill Steingraus. There are two probably Spanish. They walked arm and arm. There I am. That plastic raincoat with Bird to Nimothy. You Wiley's walking the course. You'll see the masses of people. There uh, I am on St. John, the lovely American thoroughbred that Harry Delaire loaned me. He'd be a very valuable horse today, very careful, very, very rideable, very fast. Here's you, Wiley. You'll see the position, which I still advocate, the forward seat, our upper bodies were well in front of the vertical, 30 to 50 degrees, which of course, the advantage, you don't have to catch up to your horse. You're already with the horse as he takes that jump. It's so easy to ride that way. But the horse has to be in front of the legs, which thoroughbreds usually are automatically. The water at Aachen was very big, very inviting, and very jumpable. There's uh, Frank Chapeau on the Irish half-bred horse, Tally Ho. It's a beautiful color. We had lots of grays. There's Riviera Wonder with Bill Steinkraus. That, that birch wall, that, that wood wall, didn't look big, but it was about a meter eighty. There I am on Night Owl. This is probably the Grand Prix of Aachen, or of cla big class at Aachen. Now they have two poles over that birch wall, and they put two poles on it. It was pushing to six foot. This is the puissance at Aachen. Here's Billy on the Canadian thoroughbred Zardes Pre. Could walk seven foot six. He was a puissance specialist. He could walk that. That was seven foot or better. We'll see what they had to do to get the other blocks on. They had to stand on crooks. Immense jump and beautifully ridden, impeccably ridden by Bill Steingraus. And there's the American flag. We had lots of victories in those days at all these shows over there. We'd win five classes at Aachen. You can see how hot. These horses were, even Zara Desprey was a thoroughbred horse and pretty ready, pretty up. And he could, this he can hand canter these jumps. His worst fence was the first fence, a brush with a rail at four foot, he'd often rub that. If he got past that first fence, he was all right. 
This is a jump off glass. And there you have a vertical to a triple bar. Here I am a night owl. This was the horse that I won the Grand Prix of Akhenaten in 1960. Also a thoroughbred horse by Bonnoui. There he twisted, but he wasn't a twister. It was the footing. The footing was very deep. You see the courses weren't particularly technical. The fences weren't particularly technical, but they they always ended up being big jumps, but not very technical or very delicate like we see today. But they were big, massive jumps like that one. They're so beautifully built, they don't even look that big. Here's Frank Chapeau again on Teleo. And uh, yet again, whether that was the Grand Prix of Aachen, this is the closing ceremony at Aachen, and it's exactly the same day. Look at the people. You know, several years ago, Ludger Beerbaum said, look at, the, look at the public here in Aachen. Look at the, I said, we, in those days, we had more public because there wasn't television, and people had nothing to do but go to the horse show. But there were, I don't know what they used to say, 60,000 on the big weekend days waving the white handkerchiefs that's still worth seeing in Aachen. I always stayed at the end to watch that and the parade of teams as they go out. <laughs>